We are coming to you live from Los Scandalous Shake and Bake Arena. And the A-listers are out tonight. You can feel the electricity in the air. Feel it? There's an electrical storm. Look, a boat just took out their mascot. Lightning blasts all over the place, Grim. This is dangerous. And danger is what this league is all about, Bricks. And the fans, they're loving it. Today's matchup is going to be a good one. The teams take the field. The Snuffalo Grills battle. The Los Scandalous Volts. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Uh, okay. Thank you. Come on. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. If you like your cocktail cold, your soup hot, and your steak still mooing, then you're gonna love seeing mutants not cold, their brains turned into hot lava soup, and their bodies strewn about the field, lying still and barely moving. MFL game day is on the air. Ah, oh, you just made me hungry, Grim. I'm gonna go get some of them extra crispy mutant finger strips. Hey, get me a full slab of broken mutant ribs while you're there. And it's first and ten. the way a Republican congressman hits the airport men's room. Good and hard. First down. And it's first and ten. <laughs> Second down in a very... He is rolling thunder and pouring pain. It's a zap attack. Hitting mid hurdle and fumbles the ball. Oh, nice hit. And it's first and ten. Oh, and did he just put on a display there? Touchdown. Some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sinners then. It's good. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. First and ten. Oh, he just got crushed. And that'll be second and eight to go. here, and I'm not talking about the corned beef with extra mayo. <laughs> Second down in a lot, and they've had enough. The offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref. Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. Hot one, hot two, hot. Oh, 
a great catch, and he picks up a new set of downs. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot. For the first down. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. A pickup of about three on that play. Second down and seven. Oh, and that's what it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have them made at the dice grim. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. <laughs> Third down and nine. Hey. Oh, and that quarterback threads the needle for a first down. First and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot eight. If you don't hear it coming, it'll and he just nail it right on the numbers for a touchdown. And he takes a break from conquering and vaporizing other civilizations to score six points. He's such a driven player. You gotta give him credit. <laughs> Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> the kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. with the brain scrambler. And it's first and ten. The receiver makes a grab for five yards. Second down and five. Well, he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a pick ahead. Get the ball, asshole. Third down and five. Caught for the first down. Another bullshit penalty. How long are these guys going to take this? <laughs> Third down and long. And the offense jumps off sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. down and never gonna happen. Hey man, nobody can touch you with eyeball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. Hey, what you talking about, pal? And out comes the most underrated position in football, the mighty punter. Nice punt. Should move him back nicely. He's got the ball now and is going to try and score. And he sinks him to the ground. 
with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. And it's first and ten. He rifled that one in there, and they come up with ten yards on the play. Second down, the size of Bricks Wiener. Hey! Sorry, partner. First down! I see this guy drop a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him a real bomb if he dropped one again. You know, good communication is important. First down and seven. Hey. He was stuck at the line of scrimmage. Second down and seven. And so at the end of one, we're all tied up. We'll be right back. Second down and seven. Hot, hot one, hot two. Third down and eight. And that was a perfect pass, and he scores handily. Hey, you see that move, baby? No, you didn't. You know why? I'm too fast for you. I'm the greatest. The greatest, I tell you. <laughs> Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. Straight through the uprights. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. Knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. And it's first and ten. And that's a sack. The quarterback has to get rid of the ball there.
was just a shitty pass to absolutely no one. And the punter takes a break from knitting on the sidelines to come in and punt. His knitting is superb, Grim. That cross stitching, unbelievable. They let the punt drop, and it will be downed by the defense. And it's first and ten. Second down and more than the QB would like. Nice run for five yards. <laughs> and that'll bring up third down and seven. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hot. Give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Hey. Foam out about a six-yard gain. Hey, do me a favor. If my parole officer calls, I was with you last night, Bricks. No problem. I spent the night in lockup for solicitation. Hot, hot one, hey. You ever get hit in the head with a boat all grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. Hot one, hey! That pass play nets them seven yards. Oh, no. I got the hiccups again. What are you supposed to do to get rid of them again? You stick your head in a plastic bag, say the alphabet backwards while you set yourself on fire and jump out the window. It ought to stop him. Second and three. Third down and six. First down and three. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. The warning sounds only two minutes left in the first half. First down and three. Hot, hot one, three. And he zips that one in there for a touchdown. Seriously, man, you think you can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me? I will wreck your world. You understand me, Junior? I'll wreck your world. Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. And it's first and ten. Blow up the defense today. <laughs> yeah. He was right. He was going to hit him now. <laughs> Second down and ten. Smart move. 
move there, stopping the clock with their first time out. And for all you know, maybe he's just stalling or wiring the ref some cash. Third down and eight. Defense quickly calls a timeout. They want to get the ball back. Boring, but smart. Time to punt. Whoa, whoa, you can't say that on the radio. And he put all of his foot into that one. Nice catch, and he turns on the afterburner. Oh, with the brutal hit. Some steam, a gain of seven there. The QB saves some clock by calling a timeout. They have one left. Second and three. Hot, hot one, hot two. That's it. That's the last time out. It's score or die from here out. Third and four. Hot one, hot two, eight. Oh, devastating hit. You ever get hit that hard, Bricks? Yep. Third grade. Sister Mary Margaret of Our Ladies of Holy Hell. I thought it was brass knuckles, but it was just a Knuckles. He's got the distance, and the kick is good. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck off. That was just a one time thing. second quarter. Someone will need to pull together some bribe money as they head to their lockers. Stay with us for the halftime show brought to you by our friends at Monsatan Industries. We make genetically altered Franken food you'll have fun trying to identify. We're back for the second half as the teams line up for the kickoff. The coach told his players they'll be strung up on the goalposts if they don't make this a game in the second half. That's how you motivate these pricks. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. And it's first and ten. And then Cats will give them a first down. I don't know if they're his, but he sure has a good set of hands. And it's first and ten. That's a six-yard gain. And that'll be second down and four. Whenever a player gets banned, he just laid the wood on him on that one and knocked the ball out. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. Third and four. And the bomb goes off, hurting no one. Yeah, if a bomb don't kill anyone, does it still make a sound? Third down, and the punter is warming up. He was 
not going to drop that one. And how have they not killed him yet? He's wearing a new mink coat, for God's sake. He's seven layers of smarmy grin. Third down in the QB. Offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. Third down and forever. really do know how to party, Bricks. Yeah? Oh, yeah, I have pictures that, uh, well, maybe I actually shouldn't discuss this on here. <laughs> and it's first and ten. A catch for three yards. <laughs> Second down and seven. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. Murphy Brown! What? I mean, first down! What the hell was that? I, uh, I honestly don't know, Grim. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. And he's able to grab that one somehow and hold on for the first down. This guy has a nice set of hands, Grim. It's the third set of hands he's had so long today. Looks like it's a good fit. First and ten. Great play by the defense. It's not too often a quarterback gets rejected. That's why that's the position I originally tried out for. I want to know what it's like for other people to accept you. Now that went from a joke to making me feel feelings. Stop it. This isn't a place to feel feelings. This is football. Foot putt. You miss two foot putts all the time, Grim. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. They need a good return here to set up the offense. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Lukewarm. And he's proud of that? Yeah. That's why he made this clothing company, Lukewarm Threads. Their marketing team hates it. And it's first and ten. <laughs> Second. 
tagged down in a very lot. That's the way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. And it's first and ten. Picks up maybe four on that play. Second down and six. And he snatches that one out of the air for a first down. See if they can get something going here. And it's first and ten. The quarterback passes the ball and it rebounds back. He can't get rid of it. It's like me and these crabs, Grim. Yep, the defense calls a sticky ball dirty trick and the QB is in a heap of trouble now. <laughs> Second down and more than the QB would like. And he gets three yards on that run. down and well good luck oh the punishing hit the quarterback goes down thank god he's still got his leg he's gonna need all of it for this kick Straight through the uprights. <laughs> Looks like they're lined up for an onside kick. First and ten. A good run for five yards. Hey, didn't move the changes, Gordon, did it? How good can it be? Second down and five. Oh, and that one's gonna hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. The third quarter mercifully ends. If this game is as painful to watch as we are to listen to, and please accept our apologies. This one is just about over. Third and two. Oh, and the quarterback threads the needle for a first down. And it's first and ten. just got smashed not as bad as me last night he may be dead but trust me he's in better shape than i am right now oh geez here it comes Blah. ouch what is this ain't he's wrestling first down and nine the ball into the defense picking up seven second and three hot, hot one hot two hot. Touchdown! oh he ran through those defenders
defenders like a greased turkey. See that move, baby? I'm the greatest. No, you didn't see that because I'm too fast. <laughs> Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? It's good. When you get knocked down, you gotta get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. The offense changes the pace by going into a hurry up. Does that mean the defense gets into a hurry up too? Grim, can I kill him? This guy's gonna get mugged in the locker room by his team after the game. Second down and ten. And the quarterback unleashes a sonic blast against the defense. And that is caught for a first down. And the hurry-up offense wears out the defense since they can't rest their players. First and ten. Oh, great throw! Great catch! And then put six points on the board! The defense can do anything to stop a throw that good, Grim! You mean aside from driving the ref, killing the quarterback, or actually playing some D? You never know. Straight through the uprights. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. He sits up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. Great tackle! When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking about that hit. Yeah, most likely in a convalescent home. And it's first and ten. And this guy is supercharged with electricity. Oh, and the defender knocked the ball out when he was in midair. It is a fumble indeed. Fumble Banji! The new game from Wilton Crabtree. And how about a little dirt sandwich? And the offense goes into a hurry up to pick up the pace of the game. And that's perfect coverage. Nice deflection. The quarterback shifts gears and goes into his hurry-up offense. And he snags it for six. Touchdown! Touchdown! Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It 
It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five! You ever get hit in the head with a boat all grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. Oh, no, it's the sticky ball dirty trick. The defense pretty much turned the ball into a yo-yo of doom. Did you ever think you'd say that, Grim? A yo-yo of doom? No, my friend, I didn't. I love this job. Second down and a lot. warming up. Caught for the first down. Smart move there as they call a timeout trying to get the ball back for another shot. into a four-yard pickup there. The defense has to make something happen here with one timeout left. Second down and six. The defense calls their last timeout. I don't know if they can pull off a win, Glenn. Why is that, Bricks? Eh, just a gut feeling. It also might be that porterhouse I ate for breakfast. How are you still alive? Drugs. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum and killing. First and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. And that pass is good for about five yards. Second down and five. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot. When I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. The Bolts get their butts handed to them today and lose the game in front of their home team fans. And let's go down to the field and hear the MVP. He's a real role model for the kids, Bricks. That is, if you want your kids to be a roid raging narcissist with uncontrollable verbal diarrhea. Oh, that personality disorder has a name. It's called autotropism. Once again, the folks at Evil SN thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's game was brought to you by the Hexon Oil Corporation. We drill it, spill it, and kill it so you...